Hello everyone! Almost always when working with carpentry machines you need a zero reference point in relation to which the processing is done by cutting, milling, scrapping etc. By zero point we usually mean the position of the cutting tool in which its most protruding point is flush with the worktop. The zero position can of course be determined in several ways using optical and mechanical aids, but the principle I used is much more precise solution that minimizes the possibility of error due to omissions or limitations of the human senses. I came up with this idea of making this useful device while I working with my premium homemade router table. How does zero setter work? While the cutting tool is in the position below the worktop, the cable magnet is placed in a convenient place on the cutting tool. Then the zero setter is placed above the opening through which the cutting tool exits and presses on the worktop so that the brass disc of the zero setter is above the cutting tool. The cutting tool is then lifted slightly until it touches the brass disc of the zero setter. Then the lead will light up and at the same time you'll hear the beep sound. At that moment the milling cutter was precisely set to the zero position where its highest point is at the level of the worktop. If you are working with a premium homemade router table or with another machine that has a digital indicator of the vertical position of the cutting tool, this is the right time to reset it so that the display shows zero so each subsequent movement of the cutter down or up can be read on a digital display. In addition to desktop brothers, this tool can be used on table saws and other machines where the worktop is not made entirely of metal. It can also be used on metal worktops of machines if they are electrically non-conductive parts, such as zero clearance and table saws.
you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the like button and subscribe. Bye.